Hello Cancer, welcome to my channel, welcome to this coming week's reading. For this week I am reading from the Lightseer's Tarot deck here, then I will be drawing out a stone, uh, one stone to see what is um, calling for you uh, the most, what your energy is needing the most right now. Um, I will be back with uh, my other kind of usual readings, um, possibly with the coffee cup next week. I just needed a little bit of a break from all of that because sometimes, you know, energetically it does take a lot. And uh, yes, so it's, uh, balance is very important no matter what you are doing. Um, also, I want to thank all of you so very much for those of you that uh, reported that channel. I posted a, uh, a post on, on my com community page um, about a channel that's stealing my videos. Thank you for all who have uh, reported that. I really do appreciate all of you. Okay, let's see what we have for you. Look at that. Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Cups. Ooh, nine of Pentacles, Cancer. You're looking good. And ooh, all right, Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, Nine of Pentacles, and Death and Rebirth card. Amazing. Ah, there is something that is definitely. Oh, look at that. The world. Something. You, you're reaping the 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 um. Hmm. Hang on. Hang on. There is something that you're about to um, reap the rewards. Oh, look at this. Look at this spread. You're about to reap the rewards here of um, things that um, are going to transpire in a material way and an emotional way. I do see there's something here that you almost gave up on. Um, and realizing also that... Um, here with the Ace of Pentacles, it's almost like this great new chance that's coming in. Like another chance, but it, it there's a lot more momentum behind it. Something feels a lot different. Very powerful. Having to also, what I do here right now is something about forgiveness. Forgiving the past, forgiving uh, many, many things in order for you to... Go down this road in a clear new way. There is a new journey definitely here beginning. And good luck that you have been creating for yourself as well. There is, I, I see a lot of drive here, a lot of drive, a lot of passion for what you love to do. And there is, it could be like, I, I get like a chance encounter, something here that may take you um, by surprise. It's the... It feels almost like you you gave it your all. You didn't quite see um, the results that you were hoping to. However, that doesn't mean that that was it. There's, there's, it's like you presented something, nothing quite came about at that moment, but it comes through later, if that makes sense. You know, it's it's just because it didn't come through on um, at that time, on that meeting, or whatever it was. It doesn't mean that um, whoever it is or that situation still doesn't um, still is not it's not thinking about you or or what you have to give. And what I do see that is coming to you. It's like timing has. A major part in this so it's it's like it, it comes in when you least expect it a really good fortune is coming in when you least expect it allowing you to have um, multiple choices and what you want to do you are not being restricted in any way there is good fortune good love as well you're starting to really connect the dots in terms of certain mysteries in your life that have been happening. Things that you sometimes couldn't understand, you struggle to see. But as soon as you think less about those things, be in the present, let go of certain things, there's a big, big turnaround happening. Big turnaround. There's a 
very bright new beginning starting here. And, and I do see there is victory as well. That's what I'm sensing here, victory. The past is the past. It's not even been thought about anymore. There is too much good fortune coming in for you. A lot of fulfillment here within yourself, in your heart, emotionally. Something that you're going to start to see produce wonderful results. Results that may come through in ways that you didn't expect. And I do see, you know, especially here, the, straight after the death card, we get the world. It's an exciting time for you. That's what I see. A very, very exciting time. Something that, what I do also say, see, there's a buzz around you. There's a buzz. There's a buzz. It's like your name is is out there. There is something here that you may see um, repeat customers or clients. If you work for yourself, for example, you know, there is this good steady income um, flow of income or, or possibly extra um, streams of income. There is something that you've, I do see you've worked diligently and here, you know, with the three of swords, especially just before the ace of cups, there were certain things in order for you to carry on and really open yourself up open yourself up to new opportunities there is some sort of confrontation that i see that um there's a willingness to also confront that needing realizing the need to go to the root of certain issues so you no longer have this layer that not everybody can see that you don't necessarily always uh, see or want to look at of of pain that is to be released and what i do also see certain things will come through and you're like oh yes that i do sense there's some disappointment and that could be people's true colors certain things that will come through but if you have a look the way it's presented itself it shows that the universe only wants you to be surrounded by those that you can trust, by those that have your back. And this, I see, is the final push to that release. Final push and letting go of any negative um, cords, attachments. There is a change in karma here with this Three of Swords, a change in karma. You are being released in such a way that you, you will see yourself on top of the world. With the Ace of Cups, this glorious fulfillment, this abundance coming through you, receive that peace, that happiness. And I, I do see some sort of uh, big chance that's coming in, a chance that will help um, transform many, many things for you within your heart, in the in the material aspect as well. There is... An immense deep fortune after difficulty happening here. And this sorrow, whatever that may be, is a thing of the past that you are no longer allowing to um, carry on forward with you wherever you are. I do also sense here that you've mastered something so well that, um, you know, you should be very, very proud of it, whatever it may be. You know, whether it's quitting bad habits or starting a new um, routine, there is something that you are doing that's getting you to the to, to where you want to be, getting you to the top, the top of your field. Definitely like a very powerful transformative period here. The abundance is, is, is a lot. <laughs> a lot of abundance is showing here. And what I do see, you know, there is a lot of calm as well. If you've had chaos, there will be a lot of calm. Something, there's like a, yeah, a surprise, um, almost like a surprise gift from the universe coming to you. I'm loving this. Okay, let's see what stone is calling for you now. What can that be for cancer? What stone for cancer? For cancerians. Oh, okay. We have the clear quartz. This is for you to get complete healing, as we we're talking about. 
master healing or maybe that you know when i said something that you are that you've mastered and this is the stone of of um, master healer huh? something that you are completely going through a very deep cleanse refusing to take it any further and completely clearing all of that allowing you to have great clarity great balance clarity and allowing a lot of creativity also to come through that that will help you gain the abundance that is coming through the creativity that you use it could be in anything that you do oopsie sorry any kind of job that you do anything that you put your mind to it shows that you've got what it takes to create that create it into something successful for yourself and and clarity for sure you have here one after the other a lot of clarity because you've gone through this healing process because you know yourself you're placing yourself in a very powerful position you know where you stand because you say so you're not waiting for anybody else to tell you where you stand you have a lot of this freedom Cool, very strong for you, Cancer. Thank you so very much. I really hope that this was helpful. Please do let me know. I appreciate all of you so very much. I truly do. Please do take care and until next time.